Okay, welcome back. Today we're going to build this 1932 uh, Ford sedan delivery, Coca-Cola delivery truck. Or car, whatever it is. So, here's the part. We got this small cab. If you compare it to my other models, this is small. Then you got the interior. And this is older than two different colors for some odd reason. We got black. This is like the somewhat part frame. Then you got the frame. And then you got the exhaust system right there. We got motor, interior, and tire parts. And we got seat. Two seats and a lovely dash. And we got the rest of the body stuff. Like the grill and the hood and all that. Probably maybe interior, not sure. And then over here, we got a massive chrome tree. Like, there's a lot of suspension stuff that's molded in chrome. Then we got a Ford license plate right there. You can tell. Then we got a smaller chrome tree. More so motor stuff. Well, it's this piece that came off the big tree. Then you got four Goodyear tires. You got big tires for the back and small tires for the front. Then you got one metal axle. Windshield pieces and headlights. And then you got the big decal. She big decal. So I guess with these, you can probably put on top if you want to do, or the Coca-Cola bottle. And it got the same license as uh, the Coca-Cola trucks do. And George in Mississippi and Michigan. It's almost, well, like, might as well get a semi and put these on. Semi trailer. And then last, certainly not least, we got the directions that we don't even care about, right? When we come back, I'll we'll show you the paints we'll be spraying. And then after that, we'll get into our first build update. So, stay tuned. Okay, here's the paints that we'll be using. Regal Red for the fenders. A matte finish. Basically, matte black or flat black for the interior. And when we had spray painted, what was black on the trees. Clear coat for the body. Metallic for the exhaust system and a primer for the engine. And then you know, this is what we sprayed the engine a gloss dark blue. And then here's some glue we'll be using. Cement that we'll be using for the windows. A razor blade knife. My trusty pliers. Hobby knife. And chrome sharpie. So when we come back, we'll have our first build update. So. Stay tuned. Okay, here's our first build update. Got the uh, lovely motor all assembled. Got the frame put together, took me a little bit because I, I had a little problems. Here's what the body looks like. Along with the fender well stuff. And then I'll go back and paint these. And then interior. Got the shifter. Into the light so you can see. And did the seats. And I left the dash out to show you like I always do. And then got the steering wheel done. And got the grill put together. Put the body thing in the rear 
And you got the wheels put together. That's the back. That's the front. And I got the hood drying there. And there's right there. It's practically white. Because I took it off and uh, off the tree and I forgot to paint it black. So. And also, that's the tiny firewall. So, when we come back, we'll probably have the a second build update, probably halfway done or something like that. And you know, there's a ladybug right there, if you can see. But so, stay tuned for the next build update. Build update number two. I thought I'll show you guys before I put the body on. But I got the motor and the fender wheel stuff on, and I got the tire. Mm -hmm. Got the terrier inside and a windshield and back glass put on. And I got the headlights put in, so not too much left to do. Put the body on, the front slash radiator on, headlights, bumper, back bumper, and headlights. And the lights will blue. And then that's it for building and then the decals. So when we come back, we'll probably have the complete car put together. Or I might put the body on and the front end. This is give you all an idea of what it's going to look like and before I put the chrome stuff on and then that's probably when I'll put everything on for the final build update so stay tuned okay here's what it looks like the after oh, before all the chrome stuff and decal stuff with the body here's what it looks like in there Got the radiator support thing on. So when we come back, we'll have all the chrome stuff on and all decals on. So stay tuned. And while you're waiting, go subscribe right now. Okay, here it is. It's completed. Okay, it's 1932 Ford sedan. Okay. Then decided not to put a last plate on because of that. But it looks like up underneath. And then time to show the motor. Switch hands. There's the motor. So, comment down below which one, which model you think I should build next. Uh, well, if truck or car. If you want me to do some more cool color kits, comment down below with that. Always subscribe. I say there always. Uh, and I think for my next build, I want to do a 116 scale car. Take a break from these 125 scale cars. And if you want me to do any build that I don't have, comment down below too. So, stay tuned for the next build.